again, this is Joseph Propati, and this will be my second of the easy videos, uh, easy level videos for my game Escape the Alps. Uh, if you watched the last one, it was kind of a quick one. I got shot by the sniper and got knocked off the rock face, so I thought I would do another one. So this is my second easy level video, and uh, we're going to go through this one a little bit quicker since uh, you saw a lot of the rules on the first one. So this one, I'll set this up. Again, just a refresher, we have um, two snow cards, two rock cards, with how, which each have two blue octagon and two rock cards that have one octagon. So I've already randomly picked the ones I want, um, or for each of those. And then I will swap a few of these around. Okay, so I've got my base card. This time I'll flip it, since I used the other one last time. And I will take this card. Ooh, and a snow card. All right, snow train card. So let's go ahead and fill this one up with our components. And we'll roll real quick for our start. Three, oh, three again, so one, two, three. Make sure we got a six. Not too bad. Got a little route there. And let's do our train shift. Six. So that means uh, one, two. Remember, you gotta chain, you gotta shift them both. And then this one gets shifted, but it's four, so it'll stay right there. Now remember the rules, if you land in any of these spots where the track marker is on the snow. That's a snow condition and it will have an effect and possibly cause you to slip. So we will get to that when we reach that card. So, <clears throat> and you saw in the rules where I talked about last video, if you now get four of a kind, uh, one, two, three, four, two, three, four, five, or three, four, five, six, you get to add the fifth dice. It, it doesn't just happen on four of a kind. So we're using that rule in this video and we will go ahead and start. All right, here we go. Turn one, let's do our roll. <clears throat> so close, two, three, four, six. All right, so remember sixes, you can put anything you want. So I wanna get to here fast, so four, 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 two. All right, so we'll go, change that to a four, because we're gonna go boom, boom. At least we'll see this. And then a two, a three. Let's see if that works. Okay. So first turn starts. So we got a four, a four. That's good. We don't lose any stamina. And then a two. And can't do a three, so we just stay right there. Turn two. Just a quick reminder too, if you didn't watch the last video, what we've added to this new level is some of the mechanics are we still have our stamina loss which means there are now three turns where we will lose three stamina total and these little red boxes where the sniper takes starts taking shots at you that sniper will continue to take shots at you until you get to a safe zone so it's critical that you one don't pass them because if you pass safe zone you're going to lose the stamina and if he's shooting at you you definitely want to get that safe zone so <clears throat> once you hit it then he'll stop shooting at you but every time you keep taking a turn that chance gets higher and higher for him to shoot you. So, eh, and if you watch the last video, you'll see what happened to me when I got shot by the sniper. Okay, so turn, turn. So I want to get over here. So I can do a one and a one. Let's see here. It's a three. So, um, I'm sorry, that was a six. Stop moving these. So I got. One, one, and I got a five in there. Hmm, one, five, just like going backwards. So, one, five, <laughs> one, one, five, and three. Man, I'm going to be going through there. Eh, we'll just do that. One, let's see how this looks like. Five, and three, one, one, five. 
and 3. All right, at least we'll get to one of those. So, 101. Let's see what this gives us. Oh, an 11. Great. Strong handhold. All fall slides and or slips are ignored. Great. And then we have 5, so it goes back here. And a 3, which goes here. Like I said, as long as you're even to it, you're okay. But once you pass that blue, you're going to lose stamina. So here we go. Whew. Good. We've got some 6s because I really need to get over to that. <clears throat> so, two and a three and two sixes, which we can change whatever. So, I could do a two and then a two. So, I don't have to hit that hazard. And then a three. So, let's do a two. Because remember, two goes up or down. Change this to a two. Because I really don't want to hit the hazard. So, two, two, then a three. And then we'll do a four. Ah, I love how we can plan these routes. This is great. So we've got two and two. Good. We're, we're doing good. And we got three and a four. Perfect. All right. But now, this turn, we are going to get attacked by some, the sniper and we do an event change. Now remember, when you flip over the vent, you got to roll to see what happens. Now, hopefully we won't roll a two or a twelve. <clears throat> which we didn't, which is good. We got a seven, which means nothing happens. Perfect. Oh, nice. But <clears throat> we have a sniper shot. So same thing. Just don't want to roll snake eyes. A six. Great. So I need to do a beeline there. So let's fill this up. Our components. And we got to get there as fast as possible. Because every turn we take his chance gets a little better of him shooting us. So, let's see what our route is. Two, two, oh, twos are good on this one. Two, two, four, and five. So, we go two, two, four, and five. The five, that doesn't help, but I can make one of these twos something else. So, I got a two, all right, and then I could do a one, but a two, two, four, and five. That's, I think that's better. So we'll do two, 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 four, and five. Yeah. Five can't do much about. So we got two, two, four, and five. Okay. So now we do our next turn. First thing we do, sniper shot. Now... Just like last time, <laughs> last video, I just don't want a two or three. Ah, good. Okay, so still get there to get him to stop shooting. If I pass this blue, not only will I lose the stamina, but he will continue shooting me until I get to this next safety. So it's critical that you do not pass that blue. So here we go. Good, a six. I don't like the four and the five, but three, four, five, six. Great, we get to add this fifth dice, and we roll again. Oh, this one's even better. Two sixes, a one, a two, and a five. Perfect. So, a two, a one, and a one. So we got a two, a one, and a one. All right, so that will get me there. So it'll stop shooting at me, so we won't take a shot in the next one. Then we can do... Let's see here. Uh, I can do, oh, a five and a four. Perfect. So we got two, one and one, five and four. Oh, that was a really good one. That was really good. So now I'm not going to get shot at anymore, and I'm still not losing salmon. So that's great. So we go to turn six. Let's roll. All right, one of these I can change, so. Uh, I can do a four, a three. I don't want to get in the snow just yet, so a four, a three, a one, and a four. Oh, I can change one of these, though. So let's do a four to get to the green. 
and we'll do a one, a three, and then we'll change this to a three. Much better. Okay. So we've got four. It's this one we've got to take off, so draw a new one. Ten. Good handhold. Balls become slides, slides become a slip, and slip is ignored. That's good. So we can take these off. Alright, so that's four. And then we got one. And three, three. So we are in. So that gets not used. And we can take this card, put it up. Uh, let's go ahead and slide. Take that one off and slide this down. And now we will draw two more. Got this one. Oh, good luck. I only have one snow in this. So let's do our shifts. Ooh, a six. So that's one, two. And the shifts with it. Okay. And the next one, a two. So that shifts one. Okay. And we'll fill this up. And this is tough because we do not want to hit. But see, going to be hitting the snow when we get there anyways. So let's roll the first one. So six, no extra dice, but we do get to change this to whatever we want. So uh, we can make, let's see, a one and a three, and then I'd say a five and a four. So we'll change this to a five. So we'll go one, three, five, and four. One, three, five, and four. Okay, so this is the only one that's in the snow, but can't avoid it. So one, and then we're in there. Now, when you're in the snow, let's see, so we'll go. Okay, so now that we're in the snow, we need to change this condition card to the snow condition card and we're still in the night so that's where I'm now now what happens is when you land on snow you immediately have to roll on the snow condition and whatever the rules are this is scary because there's fall you know there's drops and there's only one spot where nothing happens so that's why it's critical to avoid the snow areas because every time you touch it that's any one of these little X's markers these track markers are touching the snow that's it got to roll in here so we are have landed on here and we have to roll on the snow conditions for night so oh nice seven nothing happens great roll Whew. okay now we've got five and we have a four All right so landed our next turn on green so that means we lose a stamina point Oh, we want to do a little zigzag. So no matter what, I'm going to have to hit those and they're going to be snow. So that one isn't. So we'll probably try and hit that. But nope, the marker's not in it. So that's good. So I lost my stamina. Let's do our roll. So five, six, three, four, five, six. Great. We get this fifth die. Oh, a lot of fours. But that means four of a kind. So, not four of a kind, but I get to change two of those. Okay, so I know I want to change this to a two. Because we want that way. And then we want to use a four. All right. Two and four. And then we want another two. So we're going to change one of these to a two. Like so. And then we'll cross over and do a four. And beautiful. Three. Oh, that's that's nice. Do a little zigzag pattern up there. All right. So 
because uh, the next one's going to be Sniper, and we want to get as close to that as we can. So, let's see, can I do that? If I can't get up there, I may just have to drop that one, just stay. So, we go two, there, and four, so good. We're safe, we're not going to lose any stamina. We go two, let's see what, oops, let's see what we're rolling. Okay. Let's get this centered over. Sorry. And let's see what that is. Eight. Clear path. No more one rock condition roll. Great. Uh, then we have a two. So that was a two. Then we have a four. And can't go three, so it stays right there. All right. Okay, let's see what we got. Um, we will start our next turn. Uh, let's see. So we'll get ready to start our next turn. And I'm going to need to get by rolling either a one or two. Okay. Okay, sorry, I had to do a quick battery change. So we are starting turn eight. And we're getting ready to leave this snow card and we will flip that once we do so we will change this to a day but uh we can use the next one because our next well not yet because we may have to go to the right so that we may still hit snow and then we'll flip it once we get into here okay so we have that's the new card and a sniper shot so please no snake eyes ah, good nine we're good so let's go ahead and roll our first four dice. One, 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 one. Okay, we can change two of those. Not bad. And that's good because we need a two. So we can go here and then a one. All right, and then I can still change one of these. So two, one. Let's see, I got a five in there. So it's like one and five. Yeah. Fill these up. And take that from there because we're going to be on the new card. Alright, so two, one, one. And we'll just do two, one, one, and five. Okay. So two, and we're out of this card. One, one, and five. Now we can change this to the normal day rock condition. Got to remember that. Try and remember which card you're on because <laughs> this has a big difference than snow. Uh, and we can slide this down. And then flip this over here. Go ahead and do that last rotate, which is a one. So one, two. And they, I could be doing this backwards. One could actually be left. I, I'm, you know, it's it's okay. Either as long as you do one or two for one side, one or two for the other side. That's the shift. But I think in the rules, it's one and two is left, and five and six is right. But it, it's okay. It, that has as long as you're doing the amount uh, on the rotate on the shift. All right, so. Well, we're looking pretty good. I think we're going to do this one if we don't get shut off the rock. Um, so we have our next one is nine, and it gets another shot at us because we're not there yet. Nothing, which is good because it would be two or three, would not be off. And let's do our roll. All right, six, two, four. So, okay, so those two can be rolled. So this is good. We got four, and we'll do a two. And then a two and a one. I like that. So a four, a two, so four, two, two, and a one. Oh, this is a good roll. Okay, so we're on nine. So we let's go through. We got four, two, we're safe. No more shots, and we don't lose stamina. Two and one. Nice. 
from 10. Oh, look at the two sixes, this is great. That was a six. So, two, four, six, and six. Okay, so we want to get over, so we want two and a three, and a four and a three. Oh, that's gonna be good. Two, and a three, two, three, four, and a three. I am just screaming up this mountain. This is going to be a good one. So we got two, three, no stamina loss, four, and three. And we're on the next card. Zipped right through that. And that's, I'm actually really lucky because I don't, I didn't get any snow cards except for the one, so that, that helped. All right, and a green one. So we're on turn 10. Two, four, four, and five. So we get to change one of these. Okay, I want to get to this blue one. So, so two, four. We do a four and then a five. That'll work. Two, four, four. Didn't have to change these. Cool. So two. Let's see what that is. Five. So a dry, dry path. Ignore one snow condition roll. Huh. Could have used that in the last one. And a four. And a four. Okay. And a five. All right. Eleven. Oh, I think we're going to get through this one. Good. So, one, one, two, and five. So I get to change one of these ones. All right, so I might as well go to that green one to save me. So we've got one, two, two, three, and five. Change that to a three. So one, two, three, and five. So one, two, three, and five. Let's see what that is. And that's a three. Strong handhold. Fall, slip, or slide is ignored. Beautiful. Okay. All right. And turn 12, which means we flip to the dark of night and a sniper shot. Ooh, this is when it gets scary. Okay, I'm almost there. Whew. No snake eyes. Perfect. So, but we have to roll on the condition card. Again, no 2 or 12. <laughs> so close. So 5. Stuck. Lose one dice. Not good. So normally we start with 4. I got to get rid of one. So there's no way now to get that 5th dice. Oh, not a great roll either. So 4, 5. A 5 would be a 1. Not bad. We got 4, 5, and 5. But I can change one of these five. So four, five, and I can make this a three. That's not bad. So, um, but I really need to get up there. So, four, five, five. Yeah, so four, five, and three. Probably should not be taking that long there. So 13, now a two or three. Oh man, lucky. So no sniper shot, but I gotta get over there. So I'm off this card. We're on that last card. But it doesn't mean it's going to be easy. And these don't matter anymore. All right, so it's a fully loaded card. Let's get rid of this one. And we're on our last one. Okay, so. Here we go. Oh, that was 13. See, not keeping track. So I think I just turned 13. And we'll roll to that one, so. 
All right, three, six, six, and two. So I can reroll these sixes or pick whatever I want on the sixes. But I got to get over there. So I'm going to be going up this route. So we got, so if I go one, one, two, and three, that would be good. But I'm also going to get shot at. One, one, two, and three. Now I already I rolled it already rolled my sniper shot for this one, so let's do the roll. So we got one one. We'll see what that is. Seven. Easy route. That means I can change any die to whatever I want after they're rolled. So so one and one. So we got two. Not happy with that. So let's see what that is. Uh oh. Icy conditions. Roll on a snow condition chart. Roll on the snow condition chart. Ah, that is terrible. So let's see what happens. I gotta roll. I'm so close. I gotta roll on this. So icy conditions just happen to be. So let's see what happens. A nine. Oh, sorry, eight. Stuck. Lose one dice. Man. All right. So I got to here. All right. And I have, I will lose this dice. So I, I'm stuck there. That's what left me. But that's done. Uh, and I didn't get, I don't have, I can't use my easy route yet, but I'll use it on the next one. So here. We're on 14, I'm down to four. All right, here we go. Maybe if I get three, 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 that would be good. No, but I, I could, I could still make it. Okay, but not with that roll, not. So I can, re I can pick whatever one of those. So one, okay, so two, two becomes a four. So I'll use that because if you go off the map, it's just the opposite. And then I could do a one, and then I could do three, three. So, or actually I want to get over here, but nah, I think I should have enough. So I get to there, even if I have enough, yeah, I'll have enough. So I'll do a three and a three. So two, one, three, three. Yeah. So two, one, three, three. I think I'm going to make it. Oh yeah. We're going to do it. We are going to do it. So I only need threes. So these can be threes. And I can do a one. So the, here's the thing. So right when I pass this, boom, I go down to three. Now, one of the things that you're trying to do is, one, you're finished in as short amount of turns as possible and have the most stamina. It's kind of the combination. Um, and I, I got to figure out a, a really cool victory point chart for that. But that's the combination you're looking for. The lowest amount of turns and the highest amount of stamina to um, see where you stand on, on uh, victory conditions. So we won the game. We got all the way up to turn 15. That extra die really made a difference uh, in this game. And I think, again, like I said in the last video, it's really up to the player. Um, I'm pointing it out in these videos to allow people to test it out in their games. If I didn't have that, like I was saying in the last one, I'm usually getting to this very end. It's very tough. And if so, if you want a tough game, don't put that rule in. And it's very hard to get that fifth dice. And it makes for an incredibly challenging game because you are pushing to the max to get, to win the game, getting to that last card. Now, um, this game is, is you know, it's uh, modifiable. You can, you can really change the level of play in this game just by adding more cards. You can just push the limit by seeing how many cards you can reach. You can just try a game where you just start climbing 
and see how many card cards you can get through within 20 turns, you know, and see the most cards you can get through. I mean, there's just a lot of different things you can do. Um, you could start at less stamina. You can just, like I said, play the hard mode where it's all snow condition cards, um, which again, that'll be in the next video and you'll see um, just how much it affects gameplay. But um, this was uh, this was a good game for the easy level. So I hope you enjoyed this uh, playthrough of my game Escape the Alps. This was the easy level for the game and it was a victory and I'm glad you're watching so if you really like these videos go ahead and push that like button and if you're not a subscriber go ahead and subscribe because I'm again I'm doing a bunch of different videos for my games or other games uh, and just posting them whenever I can. So thanks for watching and until next time.